Hey guys, Double Wide Six here, and just showing off a couple saws I just recently got. Um, I got this Still MS 280. It's the uh, Farm Boss saw. Runs really nice, really strong. Really like it. And uh, I got this one. Um, I think it's an O36. It's a uh, commercial saw German made and it has I think it's a 24 inch bar it's a beast and um, yeah both these saws run really nice so uh, I got them and the guy in his truck he had this thing and this didn't work and I think he was just looking for a quick sale because I didn't I didn't offer him anything for it because it had the uh, only one side on it but this trimmer is a I think it's a 36 inch trimming bar so it's pretty nice like arbovites and that and it's an HS 76 still so he said 20 bucks and I couldn't pass it up for that um, so uh, I bought it and the reason I'm making this video is uh, because I wanted to let you know um, all I did is swapped out carburetors on the thing this one, um, I did take it apart originally and start cleaning it, and I realized uh, there was something in inside here that was broken. Something's cracked in there. I can't even remember what it was, but uh, you know, I started cleaning it or taking it apart, and I realized it was it was junk. So uh, this is a very common carburetor that you know they use in a lot of steel machines and trimmers and uh, they also use it in like echo weed whackers and that type of stuff this one here happens to be a wall bro and uh, I I wound up uh, getting a Zama replacement it's uh, Chinese made and uh, the thing works great the Chinese carbs are adjustable and there's really no issues with it whatsoever so um, I haven't had this thing started in over two weeks and I just want to fire it up for you we'll do a cold start and at the bottom of this video I'll just put a link to the carburetors because I know you can use it in a lot of different steel equipment and uh, they bolt right on and work great I guess the other part of this that I forgot to mention is the carb kits are like 12, 14 bucks if you get everything in the carb kit, like a complete carb kit. And the uh, carburetor itself, I, I think I can get them for less than 20 bucks. So, you know, it, it just makes sense to replace them. And I like the fact that they're adjustable where the ones, you know, made in the U.S., they, they don't have any adjustability on them. So we'll do a cold start here. There is a uh, primer bubble on this thing, so it's kind of hard to see, so you don't want to forget that. There we go. not even warmed up it's already idling really nice so it's it's a good running carburetor a good running ball So anyhow, I'm Double Wide 6, and like I said, I'll put a link in the description of this video so you can get yourself your carburetor and get your steel or echo equipment fixed up, good as new. Thanks for watching, Double Wide 6.